Welcome to the enchanting world of Holi, the festival of colors. This exuberant celebration in the month of Falguni, February, March, is a major holiday in North India and Nepal, ushering in the warmth and joy of spring. Commemorating the divine love between the deities Radha and Krishna, the playful throwing of colored powder is said to have begun as a teasing game between them. Holi signifies the triumph of good over evil, a recurring theme in Hindu festivals. In many parts of India, a huge bonfire is made the night before, in which an effigy of Holika, who personifies negativity, is consumed in the flames. The inferno symbolizes the purging of troubling experiences. On festival day, celebrants dance and run in the streets throwing colored powders and water balloons at friends and strangers alike. Water guns add to the fun. Traditionally, holy colors were derived from plants. In modern times, those were replaced by chemical-based colors, but increasing awareness of their toxicity has inspired a return to natural colors. On this day, the practical-minded wear old, usually white clothes, anticipating the delightful mess to come. Virtually anything goes, including humor, practical jokes, and teasing. All excused with the Hindi saying, Bura na mano, holi hai, which means, don't mind, it's holy. During the rowdy revelry, everyone seeks to accept festive gestures in the spirit of love and merriment. The festival is popular among Hindus overseas, especially in Mauritius, the US, the Caribbean, Canada, South Africa, and Australia. In a recent trend, non-Hindus in the UK and US join in the spirit of Holi, creating separate non-religious festivals of color held any time of year. Holi is a time to forgive and forget, and let relationships be filled with joy, laughter, and good vibes. Happy Holi, everyone.